And in other news, in an unprecedented move, the United States and its NATO allies have decided to expel Russian diplomats from their countries. Uh, 17 other allies of the United States have also decided to expel scores of Russian diplomats. Now, this in response to the alleged Norwegian attack in the United Kingdom, the United States has ordered the expulsion of 60 diplomats. Germany, Canada, France and Poland have expelled four diplomats each, claiming they were operating as spies. Lithuania will expel three Russian diplomats and ban the entry of 44 Russians. Ukraine will ask 13 Russian diplomats to leave the country. Italy has asked two Russian diplomats to leave already. The U.S. government says that out of the 60 expelled, 12 have been identified as intelligence officers who were stationed at the United Nations in New York. The Trump administration has also ordered Moscow to shut their consulate in Seattle because of its proximity to a U.S. naval base. The expelled diplomats have been given seven days to leave. The U.K. has expectedly welcomed the move. This is the toughest diplomatic retaliation by U.S. government since 1986 when the then President Donald Reagan ordered the expulsion of 55 Russian diplomats from the country. I think you're seeing an increasingly um, move of bad judgment by Russia. And when we see these espionage tactics that are taking place right here at the heart of the UN, we can't have that. And this is really not just us, but multiple countries saying all of these actions have to stop. This is not what we do um, in any other place, and it can't be acceptable for you to do this. Unfortunately, Russia is now being held accountable for a lot of things, and they have decisions. Russia has hit back at the U.S. and the EU action. It has described it as a provocative and unfortunate. A Russian envoy to U.S. has said that Washington understands nothing but force. At least, at least you don't knock with your cameras on my, on my window, like they did by the mission. Ambassador, could you give us your reaction to the U.S. Uh, moves That's a very unfortunate and very unfriendly move. Uh, we were informed 12 of our diplomats uh, uh, are expelled uh, from here. And they will have to leave by uh, by the second, I think, by the second day. Is it in accordance with the, the agreement, agreement, the UN uh, US headquarters agreement? Do you? Uh, I don't think so. But, have you uh, protested the decision? Uh, that, that is not not me personally, but it it, it was protested uh, in Washington by our ambassador when he was uh, invited to the to the State Department, uh, and I'm sure it will be protested. And it's already been protested. And ambassador, we have twelve diplomats. Will uh, you? How much about? Oh, how much of an impact will have on your mission? Unmotivated. You, and, sorry, what was the question? The 12 diplomats that are leaving? They are leaving, yeah. Can you tell us a bit about them? No, we don't call, we don't name those diplomats. We, we, we oh, save that, that privacy before they leave. 